Let's play Yu-Gi-Oh! For Shift of Destruction. Remy. Pleasant Team. Alright, let's do it, guys. So, in the last episode, we, uh, yeah, we successfully, let me load this state here, we successfully defeated, uh, pretty sure it's this one, yeah. Yeah, we successfully defeated, uh, yeah, some of the duelists in the car on the right, as well as one of the drivers, and, uh, yeah, we finally defeated, uh, Panic. Uh, yeah, his, uh, he might have had the field advantage, but his monster, but, uh, our monsters were no match for him. Yeah. And his, uh, his crimson chin was unable to withstand our furious onslaught. Now, that being said, um, hmm, I'm not exactly sure where I'm supposed to go, but, uh, let's, uh, let's see if we can go beyond, you know, because cause we came this way toward the, uh, the west, and let's see if there's anything beyond here, honestly. Oh, okay, there's a few people to talk to here, so, uh, let's talk to them, shall we? I'll have you know that my papa has many rare cards. Really? You have rare cards? Ho ho ho, you wish to challenge me? Papa, show him you're the best. Yes, dear, put him in his place. Oh, well, I did not know that this would lead to a duel. Otherwise, I might not have done it, but, uh, oh well. <laughs> Let's go for it, I guess. I don't know what panic left our life points at either, so I gotta be careful in this one. Anyway, yeah, first uh, recording session back with uh, the Chef of Destruction, and, uh, okay, so we're at 6,700 life points. That's, that's manageable, I think. That's manageable. Um, what type is he? Earth. So I think I need a, uh, a forest type to get over that. Uh, thousand defense, so that's pretty good, yeah. So, what in the turn? Alright. Oh, a true video for Aku Beam. Wow. Wow, okay. Alright. So, Aku Beam is wind type. What is good against wind? I think forest is. But I don't think I have any forest monsters right now. Wait, is Pyro good against wind? What's Pyro good against, Josh? Um, no, Pyro's good against forest. Pyro's good against forest. I think forest does beat wind. Um, let's just set this. Oops. And we'll, uh, we'll end the turn. And he's off to a pretty good start, so... Yeah, okay, okay. Okay, blue-eyed silver zombie, that's... That's kind of our problem, too, but, uh... What do we get here? Meteor Dragon? Yeah. Uh, so this is a fiend with 900. Um... Yeah, I don't really think there's anything we can really do here. Um... Let's just set Droll Bird, I guess. <laughs> wow. <laughs> might start might start the uh, new recording session off with a loss, but, you know, it's okay. I mean, who knows? Maybe he drew really lucky? Or... We don't have cards strong enough to take off this person yet. Yeah, 900 attack stat, that is... That's pretty high, honestly. Um, let's just set Jinzo. Because I don't think I have anything that's super effective against the bean types either, so... Yeah. Your move. I guess uh, it looks like we're going to lose here, so I guess we'll just... We'll try again. Ryukishin, wow. Yeah, we'll, we'll try again here, but... I don't know, we may not want to take this on, you know. So, okay, win, huh? Um, well, we do have a light for some of the fiends, but yeah, I think this is over, so I guess we will defeat the fiends. Yeah, so light does beat fiend, that's good to know for the rematch, I guess, but yeah, this is pretty much over, man. Game over, man. Game over. Alright. Well, I guess we might as well try again here. Wow. Uh, let's go here. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so. Uh, can we duel, like, anyone else here, though? Uh, what happens if I try to duel you? Uh, hello? Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah. Will you take me on? Maybe? 
fine. Oh, okay. So you can deal with the little girl here. Uh, I guess let's do it. Let's try her instead. Alright. And I don't know if you can ever come back here on the train, so... That's why I'm obviously trying to duel as many people as I can now. Um, I guess we can match him. Uh, Thunder. What's good against Thunder? Earth? Uh, we don't have any Earth, but, uh... Yep, the Team Dragon has 700 defense, so... Let's try that. Okay. What you got? Yeah! Good, good, good. Reveal your monster. Like, why would you ever do that? <laughs> like, why not keep me in suspense and put this face down? Buku, 650. Uh... Oh, we have Buku, too. Buku, too. Uh, let's go... Kaminari Kozuo into Buku. seems a little more along our, you know, along our level here. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure if you can ever come back to the train, but, uh, oh man, why would you switch, uh, Kaminara Kozo to defense? That doesn't really make sense. Um, I guess let's play Buku and destroy this. Very good. Um, let's try Kaminari over this. Okay, good, good. Okay. I guess D Dragon can attack. Alright. Looking good, looking good. This is looking a lot better than the duel we played to start this uh, recording session for sure, but. Uh, let's see here. Uh, let's go with Drover. I'll attack with. Uh, Petit. No, no, no. I'll attack with Buku first. Oh, 700. 700. Nice. Um. So, winds, wind type, okay. Uh, maybe we can convince him to attack Drover by putting it in defense, and I'll end the turn. All right, well, if we can get a tribute monster, I'll be looking good here. I know, uh, oh, he got the earth, oh, that's sad, that's sad. All right, all right. Well, we can take out her monsters here. Uh, Buku, take this out. So, got the earth for my thunder, but we'll take out Hanaiwa. Okay. And then, I guess, let's summon. Uh, let's summon little Chimera. Looks like I finally did get a tribute monster. Uh, yeah, Meteor Dragon. Very good. Alright, so we'll probably play that next turn. We got two wins, so. Oh, okay. So, there we go. Okay. And this is Shadow. Yeah, so in this game, Shadow beats Light, so I don't want to attack with Buku, but I will tribute this. Four. Meteor Dragon. Meteor Dragon. Yeah, and that'll do a nice chunk of damage. Alright, time to turn the page. And we'll end the turn. Okay. Defense mode, that's what I like to see. Alright, Buku, you're up. Nice, weather control. Alright, go, Meteor Flare. Alright, and what else do we have here? <sighs> um, <sighs> I guess let's go with Droll Bird. Should be good. Alright, 2450. Alright, this is going much better. <laughs> oh, got the win. No, Meteor Dragon. Alright, let's see if I drew a tribute monster I did. Beast of Talwar. Um. Hmm. No, no, no. Let's not summon it yet. Let's just take out the sea dragon. Okay, down to 2400. And for my last move, let's play Ginnon in defense mode. And I'll end my turn. Okay. So let's finish this up with the tribute beginning and Drover. And let's summon the Beast of Talwar. Go, Blade of the Talwar. Alright, and that's game. Alright. Capacity increased by one. And what do we get here? Hanaiwa. Okay, so, you know, was that worth it? Eh, I, I don't know. The capacity is good. <laughs> Alright. I'll get my papa to buy more rare cards. Me more rare cards. Okay. 
All right, well, after that duel, I mean, that duel, I would consider that duel a success, so I definitely want to just, um, we'll go up top here to one. Yeah, one and two. We'll just, uh, there we go. <laughs> yeah, because this guy seems pretty hard. Um, I guess let's talk to this person. I only came for the Egypt exhibition. I had no clue that dueling was my husband's hobby. Really? You would think uh, y'all would talk about that, you know, considering, eh, you know, I wouldn't have imagined it in a million years. Oh, do you want to duel? Duel? Most certainly not. How uncouth. Oh. Okay. In that case, let's, uh... Okay, we got the dialogue from her. Let's just uh, do this. And, uh... Oh. Oops. Let's, uh... Sure, but only after my papa buys me more rare cards. Okay. Well, let's try dueling her dad again here. Ho, ho, ho. You wish to challenge me? Papa, show him you're the best. Yeah, yeah. Yes, dear. Put him in his place. All right, guys. I don't know if we can actually beat this, uh, beat the dad. He seems really tough. Like, our best shot is, like, get in turn one and then, uh, a tribute monster. I don't know. That's, that's the best I can think of. So let's go with, uh, Morphing Jar and try to attack. Ooh, yeah. Uh, we can't hold it off, though, because it's only got 800, so... Oh, man, if I had gone with Furious Sea King first turn, man, that would have been clutch, but I don't know. Ooh, yeah, Blue-Eyed Silver's on men, yeah. That's what we would have needed, that this duel. Like, if I had somehow gotten, uh... Yeah, if I had somehow gotten... So this is a Fiend. Uh, do I have a Light? No. Okay. So... But yeah, if I had somehow went with Fury Seeking first against his uh, Pyro, man, and then we drew a tribute, you know, that would have been like, you know, I guess Eat a Bagoon could help us here as well um, if we get lucky enough to draw it. But, you know, I'll try this guy like two or three more times, but honestly, at this stage of the game, he seems way too powerful. Uh, yeah, for you, Kishin, that's, that's crazy. Ooh, I don't really know if I want to do that. Um, let's go with a win, huh? Does Forrest beat win? I think it's the other way around. Oh, no, we got him. Okay, okay, that's... Okay, so, try to save some Forest cards in the rematch for sure. Okay, that's good to know. That's good to know. Another, um, yeah, Blast Juggler. Okay. Um, well, I don't want to do it, but... Well, no, we don't have to do it yet. I was just going to Final Destiny, but let's... If he gets another monster on board, we will do it, though. Yeah. Yeah, we kind of have to white magical hat. Wow. Hmm. It's funny, I can actually take that out, because I have a shadow. Hmm. But is that the right play, though? Yeah. Uh, there's Buku. Um... No, his, his cards are just too strong. I think, you know, if there is any chance we can kind of, you know, <laughs> get, get a, you know, comeback win, it's Final Destiny. Uh, okay, a base down card. If I can get a monster here. Okay. Can we do the first damage to him? Wow, okay. So I need him to not get a monster and for me to draw a tribute right now. Oh. Yeah, it's Ryukishin. Okay. But I do know now that uh, apparently Wind beats this thing, so... Okay. We'll defend. And end the turn. Yeah, I don't know, guys. I don't know. I don't know about this one. Man. Cyber Jar? Yeah, that's... That's a card. That's a card. Okay. Um... Zari Gun. Um... Huh. Okay, well, let's go with this. And, uh, end the turn. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's really, like, the only way I, I see us having a chance against this one. It's like, we have to, we have to get lucky with the type alignment. 
and probably, uh, you know, get Eat a Bagoon really early, as well as a Tribute. So basically the perfect draw. Um, yeah, what time did I start this episode? I think like 12.50? Um, I'll try two more times, and if we can't beat this guy, then, you know, I just, I, 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 I don't know. I guess we'll, uh, you know, we'll, we'll leave and hope we can come back when we got some stronger cards, I guess. Um, but yeah, I may, I may miss this guy. I don't know, maybe he dropped something really good. Also, him going first is, uh, oh, oh, you are the worst kind of person. Okay, Silver Bow and Arrow. You know, what's funny is I could just take a shot with the type alignment and hope I get lucky. So let's let's go with Ginnin, face down, and I'll end my turn. We'll see, we'll see, I don't know, we'll see. Well, there's Aki Beam. Okay, so an Aki Beam is a win, so I need a forest card. Oh my god, is this gonna do it? Are we gonna out the Aki Beam? Yes! Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I kinda expected Blast Juggler. But uh we can get we can get a water. I have some waters in here. Uh, ooh, darn no. Man. Yeah, maybe I should have kept Ginnin, because I did have Ginnin, so. Um Let's just set this. Oh man, I probably should have kept the uh, wind monster actually. That's okay. That's okay. Okay, it's white magical hat. So I need a shadow for that. Okay, we got Talwar. That's it's almost impossible this way. Um, I'll just set this. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. This guy seems pretty tough early on here. Juggler, Blast Stugger. Okay. Now, Phantom Thief, we can take on. We can, if nothing else, you know, auto crash with that. Ah, uh, yeah, well. Yeah, this is kind of. Yeah, I mean, I got the tribute monsters this school. It's just, I didn't. Yeah, you know. I, I, if I could have stalled it up to this point, I think we might have had a chance, but, you know. Yeah. Doesn't seem. You know. Okay, so we take that out. Alright, alright. Man, and him having back row is scary, honestly. <laughs> on, on top of what he's already got. It's crazy. Alright, another fan of Thief. Uh, Buku. Well, I think we lost here. I guess I'll give it, like, one more try, or I'll give it, like, a couple more tries. I'll give it one more try to end this episode, and then I'll give it, like, another try to start next episode. But if we can't beat this guy, we're just gonna try to move on, you know. So... <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, because his average attack stat is around, you know, 900, which is, you know, just above a lot of the monsters in our deck, so... Okay. Yeah, we've already beaten her, right? Yeah. Okay. All right, let's... Oh, oh Yugi, Yugi, you were stuck there, buddy. Oh, 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 you wish to challenge me? Yeah. Yes, dear. Put him in this place. All right. All right. Well, uh, maybe I should have left and came back to kind of reset the RNG. But uh, let's see if we can draw different cards here. Ooh, Ryukushin, first turn. Yeah, it looks like we drew different cards, so. Um, wind. So, uh, Forest beats wind, right? Yeah, Forest beats wind, okay. Okay, okay. All right, so let's see. Might be our chance. This might be our chance. He, he played for Yukushin again, but we're able to take it out. Wow. Ooh, Beck in the darkness. This might be the run, guys. This might be the one. Um, let's go with Morphing Jar. Ooh. Okay, 
I need a tribute monster, a one tribute monster, preferably next turn. What you get? Yeah, Morphing Jar of Your Own. Okay. I mean, I could beckon that. Hmm. Ah, uh, decision time. Should I... Two options. Sometimes when you have the same attack, the AI will switch to defense. So should I... Man, should I gamble? Or should I beckon that right now and keep attacking? Uh, cause that's the problem, is like, I know he's got stronger stuff. So... It, it's tough, it really is, but I think the move here is to set Time Wizard and just hope he, hope he walls up, hope he goes to defense. Oh, he tributed. That might be even better, honestly. Well, not really, because he did take out uh, Morphing Jar, but now I know, like, hey, I need to take this thing out for sure. Uh, so it's an Earth. Um, so let's go with Boo Koo. Okay, and we'll definitely beckon this. I mean, that's, you know, yeah. Wow, so he's got Leo Gun as well. Okay. So, let's actually keep Time Wizard in defense mode, actually. And I'll... Oh, no! Eat a Bagoo. Ooh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Okay. What a turn. Oh, man, he had the Phantom Thief. Man. Okay. Well, there's a uh, Candle of Fate. Destiny, but not yet, not yet. We'll, tr we'll try to hold out a little bit. Um, tribute again. Okay. So this has got to be Occupy, right? Yeah. So we need a force for this. Um, what is this? Oh, there's Doma. Dang, a little too late, Doma. A little too late. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's play the Sparks now. Yeah, take that 50 damage, buddy. And it looks like we'll probably Final Destiny next turn. Yeah, okay, at least he didn't attack us directly. Yeah, that gives us a little bit of a chance. Um, Forest. Ooh, man. Man, that... I hate to lose Ginnon like that, but that's... We kind of have to do this. Man, that would have been a good top deck, though. Oh, man. I might have blown it. I might not have Final Destiny at the right time. Well, he had a thousand regardless, so... Okay. I need a Shadow. Sorry, gun. Okay. Um... Yeah, let's just defend. Man. I feel like we had a chance in this one. I really do, but it's just, you know... Yeah. Man, we, we couldn't draw the tribute monster when we needed to there. Man, that's that's tough. That's tough. Um let's just defend here. And in the turn. Wow, wow. Okay. Alright, well this is the last turn for us, probably. Okay, but but you know, after after that duel. I feel like this winning here is somewhat possible, you know. I really do. Because especially like seeing the AI play Ryukushin, even though they knew we had a forest monster. Yeah, that, 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 that does honestly give me a little, a little, you know, hope that we can do this, actually. Um, so it was, which safe state was it? I think it was this one. Um, nineteen. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, guys. So, um, yeah, um, we still can't make it to our house and do like a hard save and heal our life points too. Um, but I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Sadly, um, yeah, like I said, in the next episode, we'll, we'll give this guy one more try and. You know, just hope he's available later in the game, because, uh, yeah, his cards are pretty powerful, honestly. <laughs> honestly, I could see him being, like, um, yeah, like a, I could see him being, like, 
being involved like in a story event in the middle of the game. That's how good his deck is right now. Um, especially if they gave him like the fuel advantage like they give with all the story events in this game. Yeah, this guy's pretty good. Uh, but uh, yeah, all right. So yeah, we'll try one more time to start the next episode. And then from there, we'll just, you know, we'll just try to continue the story. So thanks for joining me, guys. And I'll see you all next time. All right. Bye-bye.